Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to be doing monthly favorites for April. Um, I don't have that many products, but I just felt like making a video today. Um, and I have a guest who wanted to join me. It's my puppy. Hello. There he is, cutie. He's gonna be a year old tomorrow. <laughs> He's my baby. I actually do have a lot of favorites for this month. So I was like, you know what? Let me just show you guys some stuff. So let's get into it. So I went to Ulta a few days ago. I'm actually getting laser hair removal done. And um, one of the things that you have to do when you're getting laser hair removal is exfoliate. So I have been eyeing this exfoliator for a while and it's not even expensive. I got three for $14? $14. And they're big. So let me show you. I have, um, I got this, it's called, um, Tree Hut Shia Scrub, Shia Sugar Scrub. This is, um, pomegranate acai. And it looks like this. And these things smell amazing. Like, I haven't used this one yet. I'm using a different one right now, but it's just, it smells like fruit and like candy and I don't know, but it looks like this. And the consistency is, it's, it's pretty thick. And like, you know when you exfoliate, you don't, sometimes some exfoliators, you can't really feel the, um, the sugar. But this, like, it is amazing how you, like, you can feel the dead skin coming off. Like, you can see the little granules, and it's just, the way my skin felt after this scrub, was to die for like I have never felt any exfoliator work as well as this one and um, the one that I'm using currently is called um, tropical mango and this one smells amazing as well it has a little bit of water in it but it looks like that and there is Let's drop some <laughs> okay um, there's a matching body butter this one's broken because my boyfriend, I asked him to hold it for me and he just drops it. I was like, hello. <laughs> anyway, so this one's kind of broken. But um, this is the Shia body butter. And when you get out of the shower after using the scrub and then you put this body butter on, you're like, where has this been all my life? <laughs> it is just so nice. And it smells amazing as well. So it looks like this and it's just, it, it's, it looks like a normal body butter but when you put it on it just feels so creamy and moist and it's just, it's nice. <laughs> um, I really liked it. I got these three for just $14 and these are big bottles like um, big jars. These are, these are not small, these are huge like huge so I definitely recommend these it's from Ulta definitely go buy some I don't know if they're still on sale but even without sale one is like seven dollars so it's not outrageously expensive I really really like those I definitely recommend them um, then next also I got this one I got this one from Rite Aid um, I saw one of the beauty gurus do a review on this one and I was like you know what I want to check this one out so um I, I love Freeman um, face mask, but this one, when I tried it, it's the Coral and Black Sugar um, face mask, and it, not only is it a mask, but when you take it off, it is also a scrub. So not only are you, you know, take, pulling out all the dead skin from your, um, from your pores, but you can actually exfoliate your face after. And this smells like, it smells like sugar. And it's, when I used this, I was actually really impressed 
just because I my face felt so much it's like it takes off the dead skin but it leaves like this beautiful moisture I got it from Rite Aid and um, I think it was on sale for a dollar ninety nine so I'm pretty sure a lot of places have those kind of deals too I don't think Rite Aid has that deal anymore um, but. so it basically it's just an exfoliant and um, it's also you, you you use it as a mask as well and you just apply it all over the face and um, you let it sit I think it's just for five to seven minutes but I left mine on for ten minutes and then I just exfoliated it off and it looks like that I honestly think for the summer exfoliation is one of one of the key things that you need just because when you go out swimming or to the beach or anything, like you want your skin to look nice and to glow when you um, when you go out. When you use exfoliants, it brings out that natural glow that you know everyone has. So uh, my next favorite is actually from Bath and Body Works, and I got these candles from there. Um, they were on sale. I only buy buy sale items if you haven't noticed. <laughs> So I bought these two um, mason jar candles and each one was $5. Right now I'm currently using Oceanside and it has, it has this like beach smell like it's, it really smells like Oceanside, like an Oceanside. It smells like beachy, it smells like summer, it's, re it's a really beautiful smell. I like to burn it in the morning. That I think of like a beach house when you wake up in the morning and like you open your window and then there's like a whole bunch of like wind coming coming in and like it reminds me of something like that like a beach house so like beach house in the morning so that's what I envision when I think of that when I smell that um, and then this other one is called honeysuckle I haven't burned this one yet but this one smells like um, laundry <laughs> <laughs> I like this one a lot. So I work for Rite Aid. I probably told you guys this already. I'm a pharmacy technician. And um, as a technician, I had to go to some technician class. And um, when I was on the little lunch break that they give us, I went shopping. <laughs> I was looking for a foundation that I can use as contouring, for contouring. So um, I, was, I was looking at this uh, Fit fit me shine free foundation and it comes in like a stick formation I used this uh, when I did my prom makeup tutorial and I'm actually going to be doing another tutorial just to show you how I contour and highlight and this is one of the things that I will be using now because I really love it so it's the fit me uh, shine free foundation stick and it's for found it's for foundation right but I was like, you know what, let me get it a little bit darker so I can use it for contouring. So I picked this up and um, I, I kind of, there was one that was open so I tried it on my hand and it was really creamy. It wasn't like other foundations where it's too liquidy and it, it kind of just, it, you can't see the, you know, contouring effect. So I'm just like, well, let me let me get this one. And um, the way, the the... This is like creamy, it's thick, a little bit goes a long way. You can put like one swipe and you are done if you don't want to contour that much. And it's, it's amazing. I used it today um, and it works really well. I like it a lot. This is maybe, I've had this for like a week. And I am in love with it, in love with it. Something to pair with this, Dream Lumi Highlighting Concealer. So it's a highlighter and it's a concealer. So it looks like this. This one I really like as well. It's light. It's not like crazy, sticky, bright concealer. I really love how it's a concealer and a highlighter. Because then you don't have to put on like 7 billion products on your face. So this one, this is what it looks like. And you can see that both of these go really well together. Like when I blend these out, they go really well together. Let me blend it for you so you guys can see. 
see when you look at it now, it's like the perfect contour and highlight. So both of those together really go really well together and they're affordable and what else? Oh, uh, lastly, I am actually rocking this nail polish today. It's by Sally Hansen and it's called Great Escape. And I actually got it on clearance. I told you I don't buy anything nothing on sale. <laughs> so it was uh, $4.61. I think Sally Hansen is originally like seven or eight dollars, right? I think so. So um, it's just this really nice, it's like a gray nudish, gray nude like lavender color. I really, 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 really like it. And it's just, it looks like that. Um, definitely like this one for the summer. Because I know a lot of people like to wear like bright colors for summer like blues and greens and oranges and I love those colors as well, don't get me wrong. But sometimes I'm just like, you know what, I want to do something a little bit neutral. This is definitely a great um, nail polish for the summer. I really like it. So that basically completes my um, monthly favorites for April. I hope you guys enjoyed it and found it helpful. So have a great weekend. I'll be working this weekend. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's beautiful outside. It's sunny. Summer's coming. My favorite time of the year. Um, so yeah, have a great weekend guys. Bye.